Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Mayhem Bialik shocks fans with rude comment to contestant in Final Jeopardy. Mayhem Bialik stun Jeopardy. Viewers by completely transcribing a contestant's final response on Friday's episode. Instead of attempting to read the player's slightly illegible response, the TV host, in an awkward exchange of words, judged, what is, sorry I can't read this. Returning champion Suresh Krishnan met Tim Hagood, a communications consultant from Washington DC Vicky Sir a retired postmaster from Minneapolis, Minnesota. Suresh is a network engineer from Suwanee, Georgia, the skeptic surprised after winning his first three games in various odd ways. In yesterday's game, when it looked like he wasn't he going to win, he made a late smart all-in all-in bet in the daily double and won Wednesday's game after a near record-breaking 23 triple stumpers. His fourth win tonight was a sure win, I can't read this. Obtained from Virginia Woolf, the protagonist is male in the first half and female in the second. Ma'am, 47, said. She then turned to Tim, who had written, What is the importance of being earned? But something obvious on the last word subsided. Ma'am responded bluntly when it came time to decide whether he was right or wrong. What is? I can't read this. This prompted Tim to clarify what he had written to her. What is? The importance of he told the host with a nervous laugh. What is the importance of being earnest? She interrupted him and answered. That is not correct, Suresh wrote. Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde Mayhem continued. The producer had to whisper it in her ear. I don't know the book he was referring to. A YouTube user wrote. Mayhem said, what is? I can't read that in Final Jeopardy with a yell laugh emoji. So rude ask what he wrote, wrote another. Incredible there s something she can t do say it s not like that. Slapped a third. Mayam Bialik has obviously never heard of the importance of being earnest. You could only see her reaction after her producer whispered it in her ear.